Okay, hey guys. I just made this account because every girl's in their Alex Earl phase right now, and that is me as well. Okay, yeah, like, every girl's obviously obsessed with Alex Earl, and, like, I've always watched, like, Get Ready With Me videos like with, like, famous influencers, and, like, none of them have acne, which I think is super important, like, for young girls, and just, like, honestly, any girl that's, like, insecure. Alex did, like, used to be on Accutane, and now her skin's clear, and I just started Accutane, so... Also, this is um, the 30 hour wear by Maybelline. It really helps if you're balling on a budget like me and you need to cover like all of your acne. I'm only on week two of Accutane and it makes me literally want to rip my skin off and it also makes me depressed, but everyone I've talked to is like, oh my God, it's so worth it. Also, that was Kosas. Um, I don't know what shade it is, but I got it for Christmas. It's so good, definitely the best. But like my makeup routine is like me just pretending I know what I'm doing. I got this for Christmas. So fucking good. It's in the shade Behave. I know like the f famous shade is like Orgasm, but this one's like a lot more natural and a lot more like pretty for me personally. So this is the Juno & Co. Um, beauty Blender. It's like $8 and it's like microfiber and it won't like absorb as much. Okay, then I went to Ulta. I wanted to get like the Fit Me um, concealer that like Alex has, but they didn't have it. So I got like an e.l.f. Um, just like a dark and the camo concealer. And I just like put that like... Oh, it's super pigmented, so you really don't need that much. I'll switch to a brush when it comes to, like, contour because my blender just, like, won't blend it out, like, that well. Okay, I'm starting to run out of time, but after the liquid, I'll just go into, like, a powder blush and a powder bronzer. These are both by NARS. Um, with bronzer, I'll just, like, throw it on my eyes and then on my nose, too. I don't really like nose contour. I'll just, like, make it more defined. Okay, I have really, really, really oily skin, so I'll- I got this yesterday, actually. I usually just take, like, a setting powder and, like, do it in the places where I'm most oily, which is pretty much everywhere, but since Accutane, it dries me out just a little bit. Okay, so for eyebrows, my mom gave me this. It's, like, billion-dollar brows, and I'll just, like, fill them in just a little bit and then, like, blend them with- And then for gel, I just use the 24-hour brow setter, which is, like, so good. Okay, I ran out of time because I talked so much, so I did one eye off camera, and so here's what I did. Take eyelash curler. I don't know where this is from. I've had this for so long. And I just curl them. Like, there's no particular way. To know you're doing it right, it's got to hurt a little bit. And then I go in with Lash Paradise. Okay, I'll do one coat of Lash Paradise and I'll tilt my mirror up so I can see, like, the bottom of my lashes. Okay, so after that, I'll just go in with, like, telescopic, like, normally. There's not really a way to do it. I just, like, throw it on. There's not really a way to do it, but if I want, like, the sides down, I'll go like that. And if I want the ends to look longer, I'll, like, go like that. I completely ran out of time, but then I'll just use, like, Charlotte Tilbury highlighter and white eyeliner.